Jim, uh, very, well, I think we could say a good resemblance to where it can tonight, mate, there, in the old 96 days. But you get that a lot. Yeah, when the sea goes full of the truller. <laughs> <laughs> what do you reckon to that there, mate? First time we won back-to-back games since February, mate. That was Thank needed, Christ, it? an away game we've won at last. I'll tell you what, we made our work of it as well, didn't we, eh? It is, mate. It was about just staying together in the end there, wasn't it? Was. It? Solid it was. at the back. Uh, it was. The defensive performance is going to get the praise there. They all stood together again. Brilliant, didn't they? brilliant, brilliant. And uh, I th- everyone thought wrong choice again of, of players when they were coming out of the pitch and things like that when it was announced an hour before. Definitely the right, definitely right. When Ronaldo come on, he didn't really do anything, really, did he? And yeah. he might be gone in a week's time anyway. Yeah. So we've got to just make do with what we've got. If we bring in somebody before the end of the transfer window, great. Otherwise, we're going to have to just wait until next January or August, aren't we? Who stood out there most for you today on that team? Two, two, two central defenders. The two cent- absolutely, absolutely. Is Brilliant. That our pa- absolutely. That's our partnership going forward. It's got to be. It's got to be. I know he made Maguire the captain, but that, I think that's just a mistake. He's you just. And that's the end of Maguire now. Probably not, no, because we've got a lot of games, haven't we, before the end of the season? We've got all the cup games coming up and things like that, so he's going to get some games, but he's just not. He's not the finished article, is he? He's been there for a few years now, and he's still not done it. He's about 29, 30 years old now. He's not, not the player we thought he was. No Casemiro in the starting lineup, like you said there, but came on in the end there just to show Look, it. He off. looked very good. Yeah, he looked very good. He seemed to have sat. You know, he, he was talking. He was basically bo- a boss in it, really, wasn't he? You know, when he came on, he, he knew what he was doing. He's got the experience for what we need. Uh, better than McTominay. McTominay needs to go. I've seen that. McTominay did have a decent game today. He did, but I think. I think if we yeah absolutely absolutely yeah, there was no way that Casemiro was going to play from the start this morning not when he was his first game and things like that which is a shame but he he just prefers but Tommy for some reason they for, for some reason all the managers that we've had have, have persisted with Fred and McTominay, haven't they? And I don't know why it is. It's mad. There's no rhyme or reason to it. Well, that is officially going to change now with, with Casemiro here. It's got to be. Casemiro didn't start and Fred still didn't get on the pitch. Yeah. It's, it's, I think Eric Ten Hag, we said it against Liverpool, the first manager to basically live and die on his own soul. He, he didn't he change is. it up when he could have. He's stuck with a winning team. That's right. Absolutely. Absolutely. No, I think if we just stick with him, he's going to be the manager that we need, but he's going to need some time. He's going to need some time. And I know he's bringing in Dutch this, that and the other, people that have played in the Dutch league or Dutch players, but who knows? They might be good. They might be good. And, and he's bringing in the right type of players that we need. You know, the bloke from uh, Casemiro hasn't been in the Dutch league, hasn't, isn't Dutch. So that's one on the, on the plus side, isn't it? You know? But one who is Dutch, came from Feyenoord, cheapest transfer of the window so far, he's having a blind in Malassi He is, he is, played very well again today, didn't he? He's, he's going to keep Shaw out of the, out the, out the uh, starting lineup for a long time, I think. That's what's important, isn't it? Yeah, this absolutely. is a manager that looks like he's going to reward performance is, rather than names and price tags. Of course it is, of course it is, yeah, absolutely. And, you know, he, he's going to get he's going to get criticism as he goes along, the new manager, and it's, it's, to, be, it's to be expected, you know? It's just going to be one of them things we're going to have to just fight along with him back him all the way do whatever we can he's going to be the one he, he will bring us back we, it might be a few years it might be three four years but if we persist with him he's going to do well he's going to be all right up to six in the league just like that from bottom to six it shows you've done it early days early days isn't it early days i know we're six at the moment but that, that could all change but it's just good to get two wins in a row different game completely from where we played against liverpool different lineup different way of playing but we won. That's the main thing, and to do it in my own home, home team and to our home town is, you know, it's, it's great. Even better icing on the cake. That, Absolutely. Isn't it? This is the toughest question you're going to get. Who's you getting man of the match tonight? Today, even sorry. Today, uh, I think it's going to have to be either. It's going to be Varane. I think he was solid, solid all the way through. And I know that the other guys not got the height, but they make up for each other you know there's the high fives going again they, they appreciate each other and they're working for each other it's a team again you know we haven't United. had that we haven't had that with Maguire and we haven't had it with uh, you know, any of the other defenders that we've had we're just gonna we're just gonna hope it works hope it works it's looking good so far mate it's yeah battling, like you said it's a yeah, team absolutely. from what you've seen now in the last couple of games after the disaster of a start oh god where can you see us going from here now are you are you more confident are you still like oh, are you still cautious i think we've still got a bit to go i don't think we're going to make the top four still it's it's still early What's days another signing coming in before the window shuts Give yeah more but confident in that? yeah but that the, the, the guy we're on about getting in anthony yeah. is expensive it's very expensive mm. and that's going to put a lot of pressure on him a lot of pressure on him 
You know, if, if you if you've got a bloke who's coming in at what could be 90 million pound, you know, that's that's more than Maguire was at 80, and he's had a lot of problems. So if he doesn't work, we've got a lot of answers, you know, to get done. And it's, I think if we if we just if that's it at the end of the season now, we just fight with who we've actually got. Don't waste the 90 million. Let's just fight with what we've got and see how we get on. That's all. We're not going to make top four. Jim slash Eric. Cheers for coming <laughs> on, mate. You're welcome, mate. Good to see you.